what you said to me was the job had to be done either early in the morning or when the sun went down so that it could be resurfaced. Correct. What your husband led me to believe was she was crazy and wanted the job done at night. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. The job wasn't done. It wasn't completed satisfactorily. You have to return some of her money. It was completed. Which you're going to do. Which you're going to do because you say to me that in wasn't your the answer, question, though. in your answer, you say, I wasn't able to complete the job a year later. A year later. That's outrageous. The question was, did we complete the job? And Not if we completed it satisfactorily. No. That's what your original question no. was. No. No, I said, did you complete the job? That was it. And uh, your husband said, yes, the yes, job was completed. And the answer, the sworn answer, I don't know who wrote it, Jose wrote it, because I assume that's his signature. It says, I was unable to finish the job. The original job was completed, but then he went back to satisfy the customer and fix the imperfections that were there. Just a minute. If that there, one there was were, not if completed. If there were imperfections in the job, then it wasn't completed. It was completed. No. Sorry. She Sorry. agreed to it being completed. She handed over the she money. signed off the contract. Who hands over a full balance if they're I not satisfied? I have an additional contract dated August 24th that I made him sign that he was going to come back and finish my pool in November. Yes, and he did go back to when start it. When did he come back? To start Shh. it. Here's my completed Shh. pool. Shh. This letter that you signed August 24th, 2017, that you will be back to start the work, the following work, you will drain the swimming pool, add two coats of paint, and add startup chemicals. So really, what you were going to do is paint the pool again with two coats of paint. And you were supposed to start that November of 2017. Did you do that? Uh, when November came around, she had mentioned to me that it could, it could wait uh, until the following year, which it was this year. She said, oh, don't worry, we, it could wait. We'll wait until spring comes around again so we could start the what, process again. Is that no, what you told them? Well, let that me explain. Correct. Let me explain something to you, sir. You see, this is the last contract that you signed. It's signed by you and mm -hmm. it's signed by her. This contract said that you will come back and complete the job, fix the job that you did, starting in November. No additional money. She paid you the money, but this is what you agreed to do. And if you're going to change or modify the conditions of this, then it has to be in the same form of a contract. Contract signed by both of you. Correct. You got it? I understand. So I don't want to hear that she said to you, you could come later. So the answer is you did not come back in November. That's I, couldn't, I couldn't complete the job because she changed her mind just again. Just a second. That was the no, later. She changed her mind that she wanted a different color. When I went back over there, I, I, we were agreeing to finish her job. Then I went back and she said, I wanted a different color.